Thank you, Brandon. And more news tonight. One Kern County student is about to have an influential platform, and we're not talking about social media. 23 ABC's Kristen Vartan has details on one student's historic appointment to the county's first student board trustee. Tonight marks a first for the Kern High School District. We see them every board meeting, sitting on the days. Elected officials, known as board trustees, making decisions for the future of the Kern High School District. But now, a student sits beside them, chosen by her peers to be their voice. That's Anna Heron the new student board member of the KHSD Board of Trustees. She's the first in Kern County history. Really the largest trait that comes in handy here is my ability to empathize, and that doesn't necessarily just mean sympathize and feel everyone's pain. It's just understanding where people are coming from, even if we don't necessarily share the same viewpoints. It's about, uh, like for this particular example, uh, there's a lot of diverse opinions throughout the audience, but the most important thing is that we all understand that everyone is here for the students. Now, Anna's vote will not be formally counted at meetings, but it will be recorded. And as far as she's concerned, that counts for something. I believe that the board has done a wonderful job in listening towards my opinions and towards the opinions of the student. And I think that just by me being up there and vocally expressing my opinion, they're definitely more aware of perhaps what the students might want more of. Your goal is to represent the 40,000 students of the high school district. And she's planning on bridging that gap further. Anna is on the Student Member Advisory Council, made up of one student from each KHSD school. One of her first goals in these positions of influence, to listen. I want everyone to understand that they can come up to me no matter what about anything necessarily, uh, whether it be about mental health issues or anything that's going on around campus or in the district at all. So. She says her first point of action, creating feedback forms on the already implemented climate of school surveys. Not just are you uncomfortable, but how can we make you feel more comfortable? That way the students actually are uh, able to speak their voice, but I don't think necessarily there's been anyone that's wanted to sift through all of those responses, um, but I'm somebody that's willing to do that. In Bakersfield, Kristen Vartan, 23 ABC News, connecting you. Anna making history, and she hasn't even graduated yet, but post-diploma, the senior wants to continue helping others in the medical field. She shared with us her hopes to bring medical care in underserved areas through Doctors Without Borders or the Peace Corps.